Canva just did an overhaul of their photo editing features, making it that much easier to edit and render professional looking photos for your business. And today we're going through its most important updates and how to access them, so be sure to stay tuned. When it comes to visual marketing, knowing the latest and greatest photo editing techniques can instantly separate your business visuals apart from the competition. The great news is that the latest technology for photo editing is in fact accessible with Canva. So let's go ahead and go through its recent photo editing updates. First and foremost, to access any photo editing features, you'll need to have an image in your canvas. Once you have your image selected, click on Edit Image, and you'll see the standard Canva image editing tools we're familiar with, but with this notification at the top of your tools. To access the updated design tools, click on the button right here. And just like that, we can now use Canva's updated design tool interface. From the get-go, it's already much easier to navigate through and understand what each tool is for. From the top, we're already familiar with the background remover tool, but we also have the addition of two new power powerful AI tools, the Magic Eraser and the Magic Edit tool. The Magic Eraser tool lets you remove unwanted elements in your image, giving you more options on which images to use, because now you can omit unwanted parts of the image and keep what works for your designs. The Magic Edit tool lets you brush over an area of your image and then generate an item of your choosing in that specific area, helping to fill in blank spaces and improve the overall aesthetic of your design. We'll have a full tutorial on Canvas AI tools, so be sure to keep an eye out for that. On the second row, we have our filter presets, which were also available in the old editor, but now the filters are organized in groups of which type and tone they fall into. On the third row, we have the shadow tool, which is also a familiar friend from Canva's original UI. Interestingly though, we have less options for shadows now in the new UI with just glow, drop, an outline compared to the original shadow tools which let us choose between multiple shadow types for different scenarios. Before we continue, if you want to have professionals handle all aspects of your business's digital marketing for you, including editing your photos and creating top-notch graphics, click the link in the description to get your free proposal today. On its right, we have a new tool called Autofocus, which lets you pick out a subject from your image and blur out the rest of your photo. Next, we have the Blur tool, which blurs out your whole image and do it tone tool, both tools being carried over from the previous photo editing UI. And last but not the least, when you scroll to the bottom of your tools, we have mockups, which compared to the old smart mockups, offering you options in various different angles, giving us more ways to add our images and screenshots into different scenarios. Now, if we're being honest, Canva's new editing tool is a work in progress, and at some point, you may prefer the features and options of the old editing UI. I'll let you in on a little secret. You can use both. Why stick to one when you can utilize the best of both worlds? If you want to revert to the old editing tool, simply scroll all the way down and you'll then find the button to go to the new editor at the top of your tools. Now that you're updated with Canva's latest features, you can easily edit photos to your liking and know which tools to use to create the best edits for your business's photos and graphics. For more videos like this and other business growing videos, be sure to subscribe to our channel and I'll catch you in the next one.